Donetsk Sergei Prokofiev International Airport Ukrainian Miznarodny Airport Donik IATA DOK ICAO UKCC is a non-operational airport located 10 kilometers 6.2 miles northwest of Donetsk Ukraine that was destroyed in 2014 during the war in Donbass It was built in the 1940s and 1950s and rebuilt in 1973 and again from 2011 to 2012 the airport is named after 20th-century composer Sergei Prokofiev, who was a native of Donetsk Oblast. History Development until 2014 In accordance with the program of Donetsk for Euro 2012 in 2011, the Ukrainian construction company, Altcom, constructed a new airport terminal, which had been developed by experts from Croatia. The airline Donbasiro had its head office located at the airport, but ceased operations in January 2013. 2014–15 conflict On 26 May 2014, pro-Russian rebels seized the airport soon after Petro Poroshenko won the 2014 Ukrainian presidential election. In response, Ukrainian forces launched air attacks to regain control of it from the rebels. Two civilians and 38 combatants were reported dead, and the Ukrainian military regained control of the airport. Service at the airport has not resumed since the battle. On the 1st of October 2014, pro-Russian rebels attempted to retake the airport. A spokesman for what the Ukrainian government calls its anti-terrorist operation said Ukrainian forces repelled four attacks on the airport that evening. A T-64 tank was destroyed and seven rebels were killed. Vladislav Selesnyov told Canal 5 TV. A reporter for Associated Press in Donetsk said on October 1 that there were indications that the government had lost control of the airport. Rebel leader Alexander Zakarchenko said it was, "...95%", under separatist control. Ukrainian officials insisted the airport was still under government control as of October 2014. Rebel forces claimed to have taken complete control of the airport on the 17th of January 2015 after a series of battles with pro-government forces over the complex. One day later, it was reported that government forces claimed to have retaken almost all parts of the airport lost to rebels in recent weeks after a mass operation during the night. On 21 January, Ukrainian forces admitted losing control of the airport to the Donetsk People's Republic rebels. Over the course of battles for the airport, the airport complex suffered extensive damage from constant bombardments and change of hand between pro government and rebel forces. The main terminal buildings, with their sturdy concrete construction, served as garrisons and shelters for soldiers defending the airport grounds, and as a result the buildings would be subjected to attacks and suffer extensive structural failures, most notably with the collapse of the massive roof over the new terminal building's mezzanine. Similarly, the control tower was contested by opposing forces due to its strategic lookout point, but eventually collapsed in January 2015 during the final leg of the Second Battle of Donetsk Airport. Since the fighting, the ruins of the airport have been cleared of rubble, leaving behind the concrete shells of the new terminal building and adjoining parking garage. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Airlines and destinations. All civilian airline operations including Lufthansa, Air Berlin, Aeroflot and Fly Dubai were suspended due to armed conflict in May 2014, and the airport's facilities were subsequently completely destroyed. Statistics Accidents and incidents On 3 November 1996 a group of contract killers dressed in security forces fatigues opened indiscriminate fire at the plane of prominent local businessman Yevon Sherbin as he disembarked on the apron after a flight from Moscow. Sherbin and his wife were killed, together with an airport ground technician and the plane's flight engineer. 
On 13 February 2013 South Airlines Flight 8971 crashed when the plane overshot the runway as it attempted an emergency landing, resulting in five fatalities. See also Luhansk International Airport List of airports in Ukraine List of the busiest airports in Ukraine